Hello and welcome back to our Sims 4 Dream Life Let's Play. So right off the bat, uh, you might notice something a little bit different going on. Uh, we have a significantly less money. So I was thinking about this and like the game gave us 20,000 simoleons uh, when we graduated university. I think because like all households, when you start a new household, you start with that 20,000 to be able to like buy a house and that kind of thing. Um I don't know. It just wasn't really sitting right with me, especially since we didn't buy a place. Uh, we are just renting right now. Um, it didn't make sense for them to have so much money in their inventory. Like, why would a student just coming out of university have any of that money? Um, so I got rid of the 20. Uh, the 9,611 that we have right now is, I guess, what they've earned so far, uh, plus a little bit of what they had left over from uh, their university funds. So that is what we are going to start with from here on out. And they are going to have to just earn their way up to owning a house or houses, I guess, probably uh, the two of them. But, you know, I think we still have quite a bit of time left in their young adult lives. So uh, yeah, I think we have lots of time to make money. They have good jobs, like everything, <laughs> everything's going really well for them. So I think it makes the most sense to just you know, let them do their thing, let them make a little bit of money. And ultimately, if they need to get a little bit of money to like buy homes uh, when they're adults, then, you know, maybe their parents can help or whatever, right? But <laughs> I think for now, let's just start from scratch, see how it goes. Uh, but yeah, in today's episode, as the girls are just kind of finishing off their Saturday here, um, what I really want to do is actually have them go to uh, the new ski lodge uh, town. So... I'm going to play through, I think I'm going to play through one more full week, um, mostly off camera, unless something exciting happens. And then we will, that way they can get like one good week of work under their belt, under their belts. Um, and then we will have the girls take a little bit of a vacation. They'll, you know, take a little time off of work, go on a little ski vacation, maybe for a week or for four or five days, something like that. And uh, I have not played in that world yet. So I am so, so, so excited for that. Okay, so something exciting actually did happen uh, before we even really got anywhere into this week. So Salim has asked us out on a date. How cute. So I think I want to go on this date. Uh, I think it'd be worth getting to know him a little bit better and, you know, maybe getting a bit of a flirty romantic relationship going. I don't want to stick Amelia to him just yet. Like, I don't want to say okay, like, let's ask him to be our boyfriend kind of thing. If he asks, maybe we'll go with it. But um, I want to see, I want her to meet a few more people. And I think, yeah, I, I want her to be single when we go on this vacation, I suppose, is kind of what's in my mind. So um, yeah, let's go on this date, though. I think I think this will be super fun. Okay, so yeah, so when somebody else asks us on a, asks us on a date, um, it's just, we don't have, like, the specific things that we need to do. So, um, I think all we need to really do is, you know, socialize with our date. Although he's immediately socializing with this other person. Um, <laughs> which is not great. But, uh, let's give him a hug. Let's, uh, maybe share a secret. We'll chat a little bit. Um, flirt just a little bit. Just a little bit. Nothing too, uh... <laughs> um, I think we already know he's single. But... Yeah, let's just let's compliment him. He's cute. You know, that kind of thing. Share some techie tips. Where even are we? Where did he take us on this date? What is this? Oh, interesting. I don't think I've ever been here. This is like a... I guess this is some kind of a shop. Huh. Okay, that's kind of cute. I like it. Got, um... Oh, this is like a toy store. He took us to a toy store for a date. That's an interesting choice. <laughs> and people are using the, uh, the, uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, I guess we could get some food, but we're not really hungry. Um, here's a little park, but this is basically just a kid's park. Okay, well, why don't we just, uh, take a little sit on this bench here and we will just chat this date away, essentially. <laughs> Or no, actually, wait, are we... Okay, this park is in the same area that we are. So I guess this is actually kind of cute. Let's uh, let's go sit here instead. I think this is a this is a nicer, a bit more private area. 
so nice to be with someone I can talk to for hours. That's so cute. These guys are so cute. Maybe they will work out in the end. Um, I just, <laughs> I don't want to commit just yet. Can I see, I can see something here. Oh, open some profile. That's what I want to see. So we know that Salim is lazy and a bookworm. The lazy, the lazy is less than ideal, um, for sure. <laughs> The bookworm, bookworm is kind of nice. Uh, he's kind of a little bit of a nerd like us in that way. Um, and their sentiments, yeah, all they have is they feel good. Amelia feels close to Salim from good times and happy memories. So, yeah, I mean, actually, wait, can we see? Okay. Are there like I thought there? I thought sentiments like got a lot over time. Oh, okay, recent or past experiences. Okay. So it's essentially just uh, just based on how they feel right now, which is fine. I think really all that's left to do is give Amelia her first kiss because <laughs> I I think that's gonna yeah I think that's gonna just top off this date a little bit. All of that. <laughs> so awkward. All right, there we go. We got it. <laughs> I would say, oh, this date just keeps getting better. That's cute. Um, okay. Yeah, you know what? We'll get a, we'll do a little bit of romance. I, I just, I don't want to push it too far just yet. Okay, the date is over, and uh, apparently Amelia is just chatting with this woman here. But uh, we are gonna call that it and uh, head home. Okay, so it is the following Saturday now. We had a good week of work. Uh, Violet got gold, gold rating, and um. Uh, another daytime TV acting gig, and Amelia is now at level 10 of the computer engineer career. So that's awesome. Um, <laughs> we're doing really well. Uh, so what I want to do now is take a vacation with the girls. So um, I remember seeing that somewhere on here. Travel, take a vacation. So that's what I want to do. I want uh, Violet and Amelia to take a vacation. Am I going to be able to pick the place? Uh, I'm not sure what this is going to do. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, yeah, here we are. So, oh, we could go to bed too. Ooh, we might have to get this one to do that later. <laughs> I think that would be so fun. Um, but yeah, so essentially we can go to Salvadoria or Granite Falls, um, which I think I want to do all of these. So um, we will do them all. <laughs> but today I really want to go to Mount Komorebi. I want them to, you know, try mountain climbing and maybe try some snow sports, all that kind of thing. Uh, yeah, I think this is going to be super fun. So let's see. Um, okay, perfect. So it looks like we have some choices for where we want to stay. Uh, we can stay down here at um, what might be an onsen, kind of like uh, maybe a, it's like a warmer stay spot. Um, or we can stay up on the mountain which i think is the way we want to go um yeah this is just kind of a cute little neighborhood but yeah i think we want to go up here so this one is 758 per day this one is 600 per day so i think we're gonna take the cheaper one uh three bedrooms three bathrooms that seems rather large <laughs> actually how much is this 665 yeah okay so let's take this cheaper one uh, save a little bit of money. We have quite a bit of money. Um, I don't know why we have 23000 again. Uh, I don't know. Okay, anyway. <laughs> oh, maybe it's because some of that money is in our house? I don't know, actually. Did we make that much money? Now I can't remember if that's how much money we... That's definitely... Actually, no, it could be, I suppose. Because Amelia got her promotion. Violet got paid for her job. Maybe we actually do have that much money. That's actually kind of cool. <laughs> we are getting right back up there again. Um, yeah, okay, so we can purchase supplies as we need them. All right, look at this. How cute is this little place? So um, let's just check it out a little bit. So we've got a couple of beds. Uh, we have a kitchen, which is perfect. We didn't really pick how many days we were vacationing for. Um, but I think I want them to call. Uh, okay, you can extend the vacation. That makes sense. Okay, perfect. Um, I don't want to do the neighborhood brawl holiday. Um, that's fine. 
Okay, so it is currently Saturday morning, so we have lots of time to just kind of dive right into what we can explore and do here. So let's maybe start by checking out uh, this guy. So let's learn about uh, learn about rock climbing. Uh, let's go and read that. And then if we can also read at the same time, let's uh, learn about mountain excursions. That sounds fun. Okay, ready to challenge the mountain. Ascending the top of Mount Komorebi Komor is not something you want to do in a whim. You must be prepared. Ooh, okay. Good group of climbers, at least level six rock climbing. Okay. So we need to practice rock climbing. I wonder if there's a place to do that here. Maybe? Maybe it is. <laughs> uh, why are we getting a phone call? Okay, it's fine. <laughs> oh. I don't want to join the painter career. Thank you, though. <laughs> as soon as you become a little bit famous, everyone is, like, asking uh, Violet for jobs. <laughs> so that's annoying. Or to, like, get a new job. Let's look at the festival schedule, too, while we are here. Um, okay, here we go. So head to the Yukimatsu neighborhood to start out on the small practice wall. Once you've got a handhold on the basics, you can attempt some of the taller walls throughout the world. Okay. Okay, awesome. So the excursion is for later on. Um, what was that last one? Uh, every other Friday, every other Saturday, every other Sunday. Okay, cool. So I think we might spend a couple of weeks here, um, but we will see how it goes as we kind of, you know, explore and whatnot. Um, let's start with, I guess, you know what? Let's, what's this? Okay, we can start um, practicing skiing right here. We are on the bunny slope, so that's great. Um, I just want to check, what was that neighborhood uh, that they said the rock climbing was at? It is this one. Right? It said it was this neighborhood. So maybe it's over... I don't know, maybe it's over here somewhere else. Let's, um... Oops. Yeah. So let's just let's just check out the area. So why don't we have the girls at least start to uh, pr go skiing, um, go skiing on Bunny Slope continuously. Go skiing on Bunny Slope continuously. They can you know start to learn how to ski while uh, <laughs> while I take a look around this area here. Um, what else is here? Okay, that's a cute little cute little um, Yamacha. Okay, that's that's nice. I like that. Uh, we could probably take a look at the selfie thing there. Um, yeah, we don't need to go up the mountain just yet. We're still here pretty early. Uh, that's a bathroom. Hmm, okay. Not sure what these rock climbing walls are <laughs> we're talking about. Uh, I might just have to look around a little bit more. Oh my goodness, so we were skiing, but now they're just like dashing inside because it, because it's snowing? Are their outfits not warm enough? I thought they got, they're wearing cold weather outfits, aren't they? Uh, let's see, cold weather, yeah, that's a cold weather outfit. Is it really just not warm enough? Do I need like specific skiing gear? What is happening? <laughs> okay, okay, come inside, come use the bathroom. <laughs> we will, uh, we'll figure this out. Okay, so this is the climbing wall, right beside where we were originally. Okay, that makes sense to me. Um, so let's let's see if we uh, if there's some gear that we need. So what did it say? Where can we get gear if I didn't bring all of my gear? Um, I know it said something about it as soon as we got here. Oh, maybe it wasn't in the notifications. Maybe it was in the uh. <clears throat> Just as like a pop up, that's okay. Um, let's <clears throat> sorry. <laughs> let's check. Uh, is there a computer in here? Okay, so since uh, I don't know, it all seems very tricky right now, <laughs> and the weather's not great. Uh, why don't we send them over to the bathhouse and uh, check that out first? Okay, here we go. So we made it. Uh, clearly, Violet still needs to use the bathroom. So why don't you go do that? Um, and we can check out the area a little bit. So this is a cute little place. I wonder what we can do here. So I'm guessing we can, like, chill in the baths somewhere. <laughs> what is what is she doing? Okay, she already knows what she's doing. She's getting ready. 
got into her swimsuit, I'm gonna take a shower, and then I'm gonna go into the- oh, look at that! Oh, that's so cute. Okay, I love it. This is gonna be- I under- okay, so this is why they're like, oh, this is perfect for after skiing or something like that. <laughs> awesome, why don't we uh, enter in here and we can chat with this guy, uh, make some friends, all that kind of thing. Um, change to swimwear, take a shower, and then relax in the hot springs. Nice. Um, oh, you can relax in hot springs. Why don't you give him a cheerful introduction? Get to know someone else who enjoys uh, the mountain. Okay, so why don't we uh, why don't we get to know this fellow a little bit? <laughs> See what he does for a job. Um, maybe we can get to know what he's into. Um, discuss interests. There we go. And then Violet will be here shortly. Oh, I think um, maybe this was off camera. I also gave Amelia the uh, trait, the like incredibly friendly trait, so she can make friends more easily. <laughs> um, just because I think that I mean we have to use the aspiration points for something. I think that's one of the most useful uh, things to use it for. So why don't you come and relax? Why are you why are you out there? Okay, there we go. Why don't you uh, also make a cheerful introduction to Kato here? Okay, so why don't we look at the very first um, sentiments that we've gotten with Mr. Kato here. Um, there it is. Okay, let's see. Sim profile. Ooh, so he's adventurous. Oh, oh, he's married. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> uh, oh, well. Oh, and he's even like a tech, like a techie expert guy. Oh, he looks so cool. Oh, what's this? Kato just wants the best for Amelia and thinks she's so wonderful. Oh, does that mean he loves me like I'm a puppy? Oh, oh, I don't know. Okay, maybe we won't make break up a marriage over that. <laughs> Darn it, we need to find somebody just as cool for Amelia, who is not currently married, ideally. Darn. Oh, look at this cute little, um, snow, <laughs> snow ship, like, play center. That is so cute. <laughs> I absolutely love that. Okay, uh, it doesn't look like there's actually a festival going on, but there's a few fun little things. It's another human we can, um, make a cheerful introduction to, just to get to know some people in this area as well. Because we want to spend some more time here. Is that mom? Oh god, it's here. Okay. <laughs> Uh, and then it looks like it's cleared up, so why don't we uh, come on over and do some climbing? Okay, Amelia hasn't purchased any climbing gear yet. Purchasing climbing gear from any computer and wearing it before a climb will greatly increase their chances. Okay, can I purchase it from a phone? I guess it's not really supplies, it's something else, right? Um, do we see climbing gear? No. Um. Hmm. Okay. Phoning. Okay, that's fine. Uh, wait. Okay, let's pause this for a second <laughs> and uh, figure out if we can purchase climbing gear somewhere here. Okay. So I think um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and visit our new friend um at his house and see if uh. He has a computer. <laughs> because I cannot find a computer anywhere and I don't want to go into management mode to like put one in the uh in our president or in our like hotel or anything. Um so hopefully we can just knock on the door, be super friendly. Um someone hope somebody will hopefully answer. And uh hopefully they will have a computer. Okay, alright, they answered, that's fine. Um it's just a child home. <laughs> you have a computer? Please say you have a computer. Who doesn't have a computer? Oh, yes, here it is. Okay, perfect. Let's, um, you know, do a quick, uh, purchase. <laughs> uh, purchase climbing gear. There we go. That's what we want to do. And I think we want to do that twice so that they both have climbing gear. No, come on. Come here, purchase climbing gear, please. Can you do it? Uh, purchase climbing gear. Yes, yes, yes. 
Okay, perfect. Let's do it again. <laughs> oh, I can't. Oh, what? Okay, fine. Let's bring Amelia here. And also purchase climbing gear. Okay, there we go. We both have climbing gear now. Uh, so we're not gonna dilly dally around here and be weird for, um, you know, any longer. <laughs> Instead, um, let's just send them both home and, um, we will start actually doing some fun stuff tomorrow. Okay, so I just clicked on to extend the vacation, uh, because it said it was ending right away. And I want to do a solid five days out here, I think. Um, $3,000, we can afford that. Um, yeah, we're gonna get vacation pay anyway. I don't know how many days of vacation we get. Yeah, four days available, so, you know, it's fine. Ooh, Amelia's making some breakfast. Fish tacos for breakfast, how delicious. <laughs> Okay, so first thing this morning, and now that they are fed up, I want to come and inspect the climbing wall. Uh, you can inspect the climbing wall as well, and then we are going to try some climbing. Okay, uh, it's not equipped yet. Successful climb is low. Oh, really? Well, I mean, I don't know. Why not practice? I don't think they can, like, you know. <laughs> Let's equip it. Uh, equip the climbing gear. And, um... Why don't you practice climbing? And then you can also practice climbing. Alright, look at them go! How fun! <laughs> you can see she's got her shoes, she's got her gloves. Clearly we are just bouldering. There's no top rope safety <laughs> or anything like that, but that is totally fine. Awesome. All right, well, we'll just let them level up a little bit, I think. Um, and, uh, yeah, maybe we'll uh, go and do some skiing after this. Okay, so Amelia reached level three. Perfect. Um, all right, let's, uh, why don't you go and use the bathroom? And then, Violet seems to be doing just fine. Um, wait, can you come and use the bathroom, please? Thank you. And then, why don't we have the two of them just, we'll come up here, we'll practice some skiing. Sounds like fun. Okay, so I think that's enough skiing uh, for today. <laughs> uh, Amelia's a little sad that she didn't do very well, and Violet is a little bit battered and bruised. So I think, um, yeah, that's probably good enough. Uh, I actually wanted, yeah, I want Violet to go and take a selfie um, with that statue. Um, oh, here's another person. Local. Hello, you're blonde. That's interesting. Mm, okay, well, whatever. <laughs> I guess that's fine. Um, I was just thinking, why don't we ride to the top of the mountain on the gondola and uh, see what's up there? We can't. We obviously can't ski down, but I'm assuming we can ride back down. <laughs> so I think um, that's probably good enough for now. Okay, there we go. I think, yeah, there, we made it to the top. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, let's see what's up here. Are there any like fun like views or things to do, or is it basically just... The whole point is to ski down. <laughs> Maybe the whole point of being up here is to ski down. Uh, there's obviously a slightly higher wall up here to climb, which is cool. Once we uh, get a little bit higher of a level, we can do that. Um, I wonder about hiking. I think we can go hiking up here, which I'm assuming is more like snowshoeing. <laughs> Unless there's hiking like down below where it's a little bit um, nicer, but yeah. Okay, there's nothing to do up here for us. <laughs> All right, well, at least we tried. Oh, actually, Amelia's gonna try to ski down. Look at this. She just went on her own. Easy slope. I don't think, um, I think Violet's skiing skill is still too low, so. Oh, look at that. Look at her go. Hang on, hang on. I wanna, I wanna see this. Oh, no, we can't do that. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how to work the cameras clearly. Yeah. Oh, oh. Darn it. <laughs> oh, Amelia. <laughs> Okay, that's not so bad. Not so bad. Um, okay, yeah, we'll order some food at the stand over here. Maybe we'll even introduce ourselves to the um, this guy as well. And then, I don't know, maybe, you know, it's been a rough day. Maybe we go to the onsen and warm up or 
Maybe we go and check out... Uh, actually, let's read that thing about climbing. Um, I think that would be a good idea. Okay, so Mount Komorebi is filled with many beautiful hiking trails. These can explored, be explored alone, but are much more fun as a group hike. Simply find a hiking info board and select the destination you wish to hike to. Um, scroll through the bamboo forest or the hiked Thousand Leaves Temple in Sem Senmachi. Um, see historic travel shrine or hike over to frozen bridges to the natural cove. Okay, cool. So there's a couple of hikes here. Um, and looks like there's a couple of hikes in somewhere else. So maybe tomorrow we will... Uh, try to find one of those hiking boards and go on a hike. Uh, Amelia's just chilling here, uh, building a snow pal. <laughs> this thing they made. Oh my goodness. Oh, that is great. I like that. <laughs> All right, but I think uh, we are going to have to look into the hiking and stuff next episode. Um... Uh, we haven't even explored all of Mount Komorebi yet, and <laughs> we've come to the end of the episode today. So, uh, obviously, we're going to have to do a couple of episodes of this one to be able to explore everything, and I'm looking forward to that. I'm super excited. So far, this has been really fun. I, I like having our Sims learn some new skills and um, explore some new areas and stuff. I'm really curious to see what's uh, around the rest of the town and... Um, all of that sort of thing. So as always, let me know in the comment section below if you have any feedback, what do you want to see in this series, um, all that fun stuff. The new update, so I'm filming this a couple of weeks in advance. Um, so obviously it's kind of uh, it's old news now, <laughs> but for me, anyway, uh, we just found out about the Cottage Living expansion that's coming, so I'm super stoked about that because if there's anything that, like, I have in, like, like a pipe dream for my life, it is to live on a farm in the middle of nowhere, raise animals, and, you know, live that life, so you bet that that is going to be the life that we give Amelia <laughs> for her like adult period of life. Um, we're still going to do all this fun stuff while we're doing the young adult thing, but I'm super looking forward to that. Uh, but yeah, let me know if there's anything else you want to see in this series or anything else you want to see us really explore while the girls are, you know, kind of learning about the world and, and finding out all that kind of stuff. So I will talk to you in the next episode.